Hey guys, I am on my way to my chiropractor's appointment. Hopefully I can get my neck. The right side of my neck has been bothering me for a long time. I haven't been in six years. So hopefully I can get my neck fixed and my right hip and leg and knee are really bothering me. So here are the wild, whoop, the wild roses that I was telling you about. And they are beautiful, but don't go outside to garden in bare feet and without gardening gloves because you'll get those little tiny thorns in your skin and you can't see them. So they are a biatch to get out. And it's cloudy today. What's the temperature? I don't know. So, might be able to see the mosquitoes. Even though this is a subarctic desert, oh, they're the pretty purple ones. I love those. Even though this is a subarctic desert, we have a lot of standing water because of the permafrost. Oh. Oh, and he flew away. He was sitting on my window. That pretty black and white butterfly. Oh, here he comes. Oh, he took off. And so, um, we have a lot of mosquitoes. And especially in our yard because it's in a natural state. So, so how have you guys been? I've been doing well except for my stupid hip and well, the neck I'm used to. But my right hip, that's a new thing. I, I wonder if it's my sciatica nerve. I had um, sciatica issues after I had Liz, but it felt different than this. This actually is hurts on the outer aspect of my hip joint and goes down my leg and into my knee. And when I get up in the morning, my calves, both of them are really, really tight and kind of sore even if I haven't really done anything so and I got my new Fitbit my other one died I had I got the the first one I had was I think it's called the one and it's the rechargeable one but it stopped charging after well it was less than a year so then I got the zip and I used that for two years and then that died I put new batteries in and no luck so I ordered a new one, and so I got that yesterday. And I really missed having it because it helps me keep on track with how much I'm walking or not. I'm going to take you down Farmer's Loop. I don't think I've taken you down Farmer's Loop before. It's a pretty road. It intersects this side of town to over to the university over on the other side of town. I think it's seven miles long. So it will be really nice to get my neck cracked and hopefully get my spine and my hips back in alignment. I've been watching a ton of chiropractic videos, which is kind of interesting. So you can see it's just a cloudy, mostly cloudy, hazy day. We get some really cool cloud patterns here too. And yeah, so um, we're gonna just go down Farmer's Loop. That's where the office is. I'll be back. Okay, I'm on Farmer's Loop and over there beyond the coffee hut, is the transfer site that's where we take our trash they have dumpsters and you put your trash in the dumpster and then they come i don't know how many times a week and take it to wherever they take it recycling is not real big here because it's expensive um there aren't that many people in alaska some people are really good about recycling we don't just because I guess we're lazy. 
In Madison, Wisconsin, where we moved from, um, it was required. You had to recycle. And so moving up here, it was interesting because you don't have to. And there's a bike path over there. Um, yeah, I thought I'd really enjoy riding my bike up here, and I don't. There aren't very good bike paths, and the mosquitoes are bad, and so for me, outdoor activities are not the big thing. And as you can see, it's very bumpy. As usual. I don't exactly remember where it is. I hope I don't blow by it. Is it where that red car is? I don't know. Yeah, I can feel um, like some tingling in my hands too. So I definitely know that my neck is jacked up. Is this where it is? I think it is. Yes, here it is. So, see, it's not very far. Woodland Wellness Center, and there's the bike path. So it's not a very far drive for me. And you like my allergy voice? Yeah, oh, so this is like a Connex, uh, or a like a trailer mobile home thing. I've always come here in the winter time and didn't realize that, so. Okay, I'm gonna go in, bye. Okay guys, so I just got done with my appointment. And this is who I saw. She was really good, she didn't crack my neck though. Um, she used, look at the, you like that? Postcard practor having your head in that thing for like 15 minutes. But anyway, she put, she put heat and the electrostimulator on my upper back shoulder area and then my lower back and she then she used the um it looks like a fork and then she puts it on the specific areas and it tap 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 taps and then when it beeps then that means that it's been released so she didn't crack me uh this time she gave me some exercises to stretch my um hip flexors which i figured might be part of the problem. My hip flexors have already always been tight. She said it can be tight from too much walking, running, or sitting. And I said, well, I used to run. <clears throat> now I probably sit more than I should. So anyway, um, my, oh, I'm not supposed to do that. So my neck does feel better. Um, she said she could tell that the circulation in my hand was compromised a little bit. It was tingly and it was a little purple. So that seems to be better. And then I'm gonna come back and see her Saturday. Right. Bye. Hey guys, I just came out of Sam's Club. And so I thought I'd just do a little car vlog here. I got two packages of the Hormel pre-cooked bacon. These are my totes from 31. And uh, bathroom tissue. Because I go to the bathroom a lot. Dixie Ultra Built Strong Plates. They were on sale. They were cheaper than the um, Members Mark, the Sam's Club. And the Dixie Paper Bowls, we use those a lot. A bag of Hearts of Romaine. I wanted to find the cabbage, the coleslaw mix, but they didn't have it. Oops, I dropped part of my keychain. Uh, Castlewood honey breast, honey turkey, which is interesting. It had fewer carbs than the regular, and this actually has honey in it, so. And I got the applewood smoked ham, and that only has one gram of carbs per two ounces. I like to have those on hand in case I get hungry and I just want a little snack. Three tops and a dress. And then I found this. It's a NeoCell Super Collagen Plus C. I, who was talking about, I don't know. Somebody was, in somebody's video, they were talking about taking oral collagen. Um, 
it's like 20 bucks. 360 tablets, you're supposed to take six a day, but they recommend that you just kind of see how you do. And uh, so, see how that goes. Oh. Put my cart back. Sherry, how are you? Oh, I, seen you in I know. Here's some of the roses up close. Pretty. Sorry about that. I was showing you my groceries and I ran into a friend of mine that I met through Ideal Protein. She still works there. But, oh, here's the stuff in the garage that we have loaded up so far. So that stuff we're moving. But I wanted to show you these tops that I got and a dress. So this one here, the blue, kind of the geo print, this was 14 something, I think. Hannah and Gracie. Never heard of it before. But and then the back is blue so those will look really nice with my white uh, jeans capris just regular jeans and white shorts and then I found this one these were only ten dollars they were nine something so I got this blue and white one I love blue and white for summer you can wear it on a holiday or just it just looks very nautical. This is the same peasant style whoop, as the blue and white one. And again those were only $10. And then they have these little uh, lace, stretchy lace dresses. And this was 16 something. So I have to try it on. It's an Isaac Mizrahi. And uh, it came in bright blue, like a royal blue like my shirt there. I think it came in a bright coral and a bright green. But I got the black because I always like to have an LBD on hand. So, okay, I'm going to unpack the groceries and go let the pups out. Thanks for coming along with me. Bye!